Hello everyone, welcome to iQuanta. Let's discuss another puzzle in this series of logic builder for CAT. It says in iQuanta, new batch for CAT 2025, Avishek Leela Pandey promises his students to teach quantitative aptitude on every fifth day, starting with the first Monday of the month. As well as he also promises to teach reading comprehension on every fourth day starting with the first Tuesday of the month. Now, Sajjan noticed that there will be exactly one day in the month of August where Abhishek will have to teach both the sections and it will hectic for the students. That's true, right? Instead, Sajjan himself decided to teach LRDI on that day. Question is, on which date and day of the month students will have that LRDI session? So, it's a very amazing question. Now, there could be two different ways to solve this. If you uh, don't want to be very technical, then uh, we can start with simply that uh, Monday. The Monday is nothing but the first day <coughs> of the August month, right? So, if Monday is on the first day 1st of August. If Monday is on 1st of August, then what we can say that uh, the days that he will be teaching QA, quantitative aptitude, will be 1 on Monday, starting with the 1st Monday, then every 5th day, means 6th of August, 11th of August, 16th of August, 21 of August, 26th of August, and 31st of August. On these seven, six days, seven days, he will be teaching quant. And uh, what about RC? He will be starting with Tuesday, right? He will be starting with the first Tuesday of the month and then he will teach RC on every fourth day. So he will be starting with second, then sixth, then tenth, fourteenth, eighteenth, twenty-two, twenty-six, and thirty. On these dates, on these five days, Avishik will be teaching reading comprehension. Now, let's see, uh, Sajjan noticed that there, is, there will be exactly one day where he will have to teach both, right? But uh, <clears throat> in this case, if you see, we have six, which is common in both two. Then we have 26 as well, which is common in both of these two dates, right? So definitely, we are not talking about this combination. Then, if we say that Monday will be on 2nd August, if Monday will be on 2nd August, then Abhishek will be teaching <coughs> quant on 2nd of August, then every 5th day. So, 2, 7, 12, 17, 22, 27, that's it, right? And then he will be teaching RC because 2nd is on Monday, 2nd is Monday, 3rd will be the first Tuesday and then every 4th day. So, 3, 7, 11, 15, 19, 23, 27. Now, once again, you can see that there will be 2 days here, 7th and 27th where he will be teaching both the topics. So, again, this combination is not possible. Then we take the third combination where Monday is uh, on 3rd of August. Then dates where QA will be uh, teached by, taught by Abhishek, <coughs> it will be 3, 8, 13, 18, 23 and 28. And RC will be taught on 4th, 8th, 12th, 16th, 20th, 24th and 28th. Now you can see that once again we have this two days possibilities where he will have to teach both the sections. So again this is also not valid. Now let's check if uh, Monday is on 4th of August. Then QA will be taught on 4, 9, 14, 19, 24 and 29th. 
RC will be taught on starting with fifth, first Tuesday, fifth, then plus four, nine, thirteen, seventeen, twenty-one, twenty-five, twenty-nine. So again, we can see that there will be two such days where he will have to teach both the sections. So again, this is also not possible. So first, second, third, fourth. These days cannot be for Monday. Now, if we take Monday. As fifth August, if Monday is on fifth August, then QA will be taught on starting with fifth every fifth day. So fifth, tenth, fifteenth, twentieth, twenty-fifth, and thirtieth of August, quant will be teased, taught, and uh, then RC will be taught on sixth, tenth, fourteenth, eighteenth. 22 26 and 30 once again we have two days which are common here 10 and 30 right <coughs> then let's consider the next one when uh, monday falls on 6th of august when monday falls on 6th of august then in that case qa will be taught on 6 11 Then it will be sixteen, twenty-one, twenty-six, thirty-one, and RC will be taught on. It will be seventh, eleventh, then fifteenth, then nineteenth, then twenty-third, twenty-seven, and thirty-first. So once again, we have two days in common: eleventh and thirty-first. This case is also not valid. So that left us with only. a uh, case which is left that is when monday falls on 7th of august right so quant will be taught on 7th and then it will be 12th then 17th then 22 27th and the uh, rc will be taught on now 7 is monday so 8th won't be the first tuesday right 1st august will be the first tuesday and 1st 5th 9th 13th 17th 21st 25th 29 on these days rc will be taught by abhishek <coughs> so if you can see here there is exactly one day in common right exactly one day in common and uh, the, which day it will be so date will be 17th and the day will be as 7th is on uh, 7th is monday 7 plus 7 14 will be monday 15 16 17 three odd days so tuesday wednesday thursday this will be thursday right the date will be thursday right so that's the answer but can we solve this question using some other method and solve it quickly let's see if you check the difference between the common days 10 plus 20 30 11 plus 20 30 <clears throat> and previously also we got the difference As twenty, what is that? Why is that happening? Because let's see. So there will be two such possibilities. When uh, Monday is on some day, let's say Monday is on nth day. Monday is on nth day of August. Okay. Then uh, this is our first case. And then Tuesday will be the first Tuesday. Will just be the next day, so n plus one August, right? Now what will happen? The next day on which quant will be taught will be five days uh, in future, so n plus fifth day on n plus fifth August, n plus fifth of August, quant will be taught, and n plus one plus four, that is again n plus fifth of august right on which uh, rc will be taught so these two days are common this is first such occurrence right now as we are taking difference of 5 here and this we are taking difference of 4 here there will be exactly after 20 days like this will be n plus 25th august n plus 25th august where quant will be taught And in this case also n plus five plus twenty, which will be n plus again 
25th August where RC will be taught. <coughs> so there will be exactly two days, right? And in this case, n can be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 because number of days in August is 31. So if, even if you start by 6th of August, even if 6th of August is the first Monday, it could be 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th. This is valid, right? So it's not possible, right? That Monday falls on 1st or 2nd or 3rd or 4th or 5th or 6th. So what is that possibility? What we can say? That the possibility where there will be only one such case, which is our second case, that uh, first Tuesday is not after first Monday. First Tuesday, if first Tuesday is not after first Monday, then it must be six days before, right? And that case is only possible. Then Monday is 7th of August and Tuesday will be on 1st of August. And in that case, QA will be taught on 7th, 12th, 17th, 22nd and 27th. RC will be taught on 1st, then 5, then 9, then uh, 13, then 17, then 21, 25 and 29. And in that case, there will be exactly one day in common, which will be this day. <coughs> right? On this day, both of the topics were supposed to be taught by Abhishek, but on that day, Sajjan took it himself, took it on himself, and he will be teaching LRDI to CAT 2025 batch, and that day will be Thursday. So I hope this solution is clear to all of you. If you have any doubts or any other method, then you can post it in the comments. Thank you.